there's been a big jump and spike in Bitcoin mining and Litecoin mining and Peercoin mining. So I'm going to try to make you a quick video to show you how to set up your rig to do some Litecoin mining. Uh, you'll have to excuse me, I have three kids here and my wife's at work. And so there's probably going to be some background noise. I'll try to go slow and explain the slot. But this is what we got going on here. In my case, I got two Sapphire 6950s. 1000 watt power supply. And a water cooling on the CPU, which isn't necessary because we're not using it for mining. But this is a multi-purpose rig. So, And you can see here we are running CG Miner at about 860 kilo hash so you can see I'm running CP or CG minor version 3.7 uh, does work for the 6950s I've been on the IRC website or the IRC chat relays and some people are saying you can't use that but you can indeed use up to 3.7.2 so let me go through the process of what I did to get mining um, these are the cards I went and got yesterday, two of them. So right there is about $350 I spent as of yesterday, the day after Thanksgiving. So and then we use this computer here so we don't have to slow this computer down because when you're using your computer mining, it slows it down. And you can see... Those 6951 cards running at 69, the other one's running at 78. So that's what I got going on there. This video may be not to be the best quality video, but we'll try to go through the process. And we have just a little bit of overclocking. It's overclocked it's at 820 and you can't really see that. 1270. So let me start what I did. Okay, first off, you're going to want to make sure that you use AMD uh, GPUs. Um, CPU mining is not profitable, and NVIDIA cards just don't give you the hashing power that AMD does. So, first thing we're going to do is go to the website that I use which is we mine litecoins which is we mine ltc.com and that's the pool that I use and what you're going to want to do there is go to that website um, there's your dashboard you want to create a login name and password so let me log in I already have a name and password. Enter your password. Okay, remember the password? Sure. We're at home. So, first thing we're going to do is go to uh, getting started. And that will bring you to this page. And this is the information you're going to want to put in your miner, your mining software. So there's some information there, some downloads, some links. It gives you an example of how to run your software. I do things a little bit different. Your CG miner, script, stratum, blah, 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 worker, password. Uh, I'm going to try to simplify it for you because there's a lot of newbies out there. So you go down here to this link where you download, there's also a download for CPU miner on there. Um, it's not profitable but if you don't have anything else to mine on and you want to learn how to do it, I do recommend using the CPU miner just because it'll teach you how to do it and then you can decide if you want to invest in some expensive GPUs. So go to down here, download CG miner 3.5 version from here and it gives you the link. It says attention, versions higher than 3.5 do not support Litecoin. That is a mistake. I'm not sure why. So we're going to click that link. That brings us to this directory here of the apps. 
Okay, and you can see the different setups. Try to get it focused there. You got uh, Windows, Zip, 7Z, TARS for Linux, different different flavors, 64. What I'm going to do, parent directory, go back, find version 3.7, which is what I happen to like. Click on it. Click on version 3.7. Um, Windows 3.7 Zip. Click on that. Okay, I want to save that. Okay, and that saves that to my download directory. Now, as you can see, I already had it download, so it downloaded a second copy, which is point one. So we're going to click on that, and then it wants to extract. Click extract, extract all. Ask me where it wants to extract it at, so I just let that be for now. Extract it, extract everything there. So then it's extracted. Uh, this is the second copy point one in my downloads directory. So what I want to do is I want to rename this to something easy. So I rename that to CG Minor because I don't want to have to type in all that crap. So we rename that to CG Minor. We uh, we want to copy that. Do a click, just right click on there, um, copy. Then I want to go to my C drive or some hard drive that's easy to get to. I've already got one on C drive, so I'm going to use the second hard drive I got, which is E drive. It has nothing on it, so I'm going right to E drive. It has nothing on it. I'm going to put it right in the root directory. I'm going to paste it right to the root directory. Okay, so because I got to run this from the command prompt. Now I'm using Windows uh, 8, just Windows 8.0. So I've got that. So I go down here and right click. Right click in the lower left hand side. And it gives you these options. Now let's do Command Prompt. So we're going to open Command Prompt. And that'll let you. Open the command prompt. And click yes. So that opens the command prompt. Now I'm getting tired of holding the camera, so I'm gonna have to shut this off for just one second. I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. Now we got another cameraman to try to make this a little bit easier. And you guys can ask questions in the comments, and I'll try to answer them because I know it's kind of hard to read the screen with that video camera, and I'm not sure exactly how to do screen recording. So. We got the command prompt open at Windows System 32. That's where it opens at. So I want to go to that drive. That was E drive. So I'm going to hit E and go to E drive. Let me DIR directory. CG minor is where it's at. So I go CD, CG minor. Okay. So I'm at the directory of my CG minor. I make sure to put it in a root directory and rename it something easy so I don't have to do a bunch of typing. So I'm there and I'm here. DIR and that's all my CG minor stuff. So just for a second, we're going to go back over here to our uh, We Mine Litecoins account. We're going to go back there to where we was because we need to get a copy of our script stuff. So we're at We Mine Litecoins. So what I'm going to do is con I'm going to highlight all of this to CG minor. I'm going to highlight CG minor .exe, all this script, Saturn, blah, 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 global, uh, all that information. I'm going to highlight it, and then I'm going to right-click and copy. Okay, then I'm going to go back to my, my C prompt, or my CG minor directory is, and I'm going to hit control V, as in victory, control V, as in victory, and that's not going to work. So we'll have to right click and paste. I know this will work. Okay, just right click and paste. Control V don't work. Right click and paste and it automatically started it. I didn't want it to automatically start, but that's okay. So we right clicked and pasted it. And it's going to start up. Which is fine. It's going to start with the default settings. And for some reason, I right clicked and pasted that CG minor script, stratum, worker name, password. Um, I didn't think it would start, but that's okay. So it started here, but what it's doing is it's mining with the default 
this worker name down here and this password is what it's using. So you're giving all your Litecoins to WeMineLitecoins.com, which is fine. So we're going to change that. We're going to go to settings for S for settings. That's going to bring up uh, the option to write a config file. So we're going to write a config file. Uh, file name to write. We're just going to hit enter for default. So it wrote, wrote the config file. Then any other key to return. So we're going to return. Okay. So we're back at the main screen here. We wrote the config file. So now what we're going to do is quit. Q for quit. And it'll stop. And go back to C, or uh, it'll go back to the command prompt. Okay, now we're going to go find that config file in our uh, Windows Expl Explorer. We're going to go back to our directory, E, our CG miner. Okay, and you find that config file. Right here is a config file we just created. Now we're going to um, open that up. And I've already done this on my computer, so it knows to use Notebook. But if you don't, if it doesn't know, just have it use Notebook to open this. We're just going to text edit edit this. And this is what the text editing does. We open it up, and this is all of our options here for our uh, our um, our network, our hosts, and stuff. So see where it says username and password dot one. We want to go ahead and change that to our username and password, which mine is Outcast three one two. Okay, and we want to change our our worker password. Which you guys can see my worker password because if you want to log on my account, if you want to log on my account and and mine for me, be more than glad to enter this information because there, you can't steal my coins. All you're going to do is mine for me if you enter this information. Okay. So you want to change the intensity. You can mess with these settings. Don't mess with them right away. But the intensity is how hard to work your GPUs. We do need to change the thread concurrency. My cards use 8192. Okay, 8192. That's what my cards use. And there's two sets of uh, options in both of these, all of these settings, because I have two, two graphics cards. So if you only have one graphics card, you only have one option for all these settings, which is fine. If you have four, then you'll have four options. So, um, so we want to save that. So we save that. Now we're set up to mine. Okay, and this thread concurrency, you want to make sure you set that up right because if you don't, you'll get hardware errors. So we got that saved. So we're going to go back here to CG Miner. We're going to just type in. We don't have to use a batch file or anything because we've set all of our settings up in our config file. So all we have to do is type CG Miner, hit enter, and it'll start mining for us. And you can hear it fire up. Here comes the fans. And uh, it takes a second. It takes about 20 seconds to load. 10 seconds. It'll come on there. And we're mining away as our user, Outcast312. Um, it shows us our uh, connected to global uh, um, host. It shows us connected to our host. And we're rolling along. And it'll take a minute for it to crank up here and get going. Now if you see over here these HWs, they are hardware errors, or sometimes I call them hard writes. You want to make sure those stay at zero. You got to mess with your settings. Um, you can change the intensity. Over here is 13. I've got mine set on 13. I usually run my cards at about 17 to 18 intensity, but this is just a new CG miner setup, so I'll change that when I go back to my old setup. Uh, but you definitely need to check your thread concurrency to make sure you keep your hardware errors down. And you do that, go back to We Mine Light Coins, go back to the main page, go down here low, and it gives you the uh, hardware comparison. Find your hardware, click on that link. So I go down to 6950s because that's my cards. So I see my card here, 6950. And check these settings that other people have used. And this is what uh, this guy, by setting aggression at 19 or intensity, and the thread concurrency at 8192. These listings will have the bed thread, uh, like for 6870, you want to use a thread concurrency of 6720. Um, 
3840 on a 6850 HIS. So they're all different settings. Use these over here to find your settings to set up in your config file to run CG Miner. And that's it. Um, that's the basics of it. That gets you going. And then you can mess with your settings from there to get, uh, get, to get the highest hash rate. Because I can go in here and I can hit um, uh, G for GPU settings. I can hit I for intensity, select a GPU to change is zero, enter, I for uh, set intensity to 17, let's change it to 18. Okay, looks like we're about done because we're getting inundated by the kids, so he's had about enough. Huh. All right, so that's a little bit. You can uh, comment in the, in, the, uh, in the comment section. I'll try to answer any questions you got. Please like and share this video and happy mining.